Hi, my name is Joel Zambrano, or otherwise you guys can call me Jojo, and my presentation is about Javier Attar. What do I know about her and what do I think about her? Well, she successfully stood up against the Rangers. She was viewed as having won, won even though they later returned to destroy the printing press. She's very brave for what she stood up for and later people tend to do the same. What, why did I pick this? Well, during when she was a teacher she experienced seeing a lot of killings especially if you're Hispanic or Mexican and they're being punished for being who they are and that's horrible to watch and that's wrong. How would I describe the conditions and the education that these people were getting? Well, she was shocked by seeing that, and later she wrote that to a numerous justice that the Tijanos were experienced turn, on, turn around the century, especially with lynchings, po poverty, and the need for better education, a total free bilingual and multicultural education. She was an advocate for this for this for this rights because she fought for what she believed in. She she believed that all students should get the same quality education as many people as many persons should. She wrote to the to to the no, numerous injustice that the to to Janos faced. beginning of the century while using her own name. Among other things, they discussed lynchings, hardship, segregation, and the need for better education, multicultural education, multicultural bilingual education that is completely free. We don't need to exclude the language, but like what they call home, but they just want it, don't want to neglect it because it's the national language of their country, and it's the people's seal. Why, why she was so successful in this? Well, she wanted to make sure that her students were receiving the best education, no matter what, no matter race, religion, or color you have. You get the best education any person should get, and. Because what I'm saying is treat others the way you want to be treated. Don't judge people by the way they look. Judge them by their actions. Thank you.